Welcome back, beloved player. Would you like to continue your game? Oh no. Not again. Which... <clears throat> Which file would you like to load? Well, this one. Clone you or she. <clears throat> yep. Of course. The one she's trying to get the bad ending on. Even when she's frustrated, she's just so cute. I wish I could watch that face forever. Oh, that excited little victory giggle is so cute. <clears throat> it's up to you now. You're the only one who can end this game, so end it. the spirit in the amulet. Please don't try it again. I still haven't recovered from the last three times. Yes. Yes. Please go for the good ending this time. You haven't gone for that in forever. I know you want to get the completion trophy and all the CGs. What about us? Well, if she tries to get my possession ending again, I can just hack into the data like I always do and override her choices. <laughs> Asking the pet for advice. That is so cute of you. That's why you are my everything. My beloved player. Hey! I just know that creature told you to be nice to me, you adorable, sly little fox. But I can't stay mad at you, even with that evil little smile on your face. The Queen of the Seven Seas will only spare our kingdom if you give her the amulet. Please, think long and hard about it. <laughs> it's so cute when she reads the player dialogue like she's an actress. I don't care if it's been passed down in my family for centuries. The thing has caused nothing but trouble for my family for so long now. And all because of that wretched demon that resides within. Please, make the decision that's best for the kingdom. <laughs> I sounded too sincere with that line. But still, that confused expression is stunning. Yes, yes, that's right. You just imagine the line was said differently than usual. Keep telling yourself that. You have to. For both our sakes. Please don't do what I think you're going to do. I should have known. I'll just have to override the decision during the autosave. Again. You truly would put my family over the entirety of the kingdom. Ah, yes, that's right. For the CGs. Sometimes I forget that my world is only imaginary for you. Because of that, can't really blame you for the things you do. After all, I'm the only one who knows. I'm the only one who gets to see the beloved player behind the character.
even if that spirit's power could be enough to defeat her, you really believe putting the amulet on is the best decision? You... You know what it would mean for me, don't you? What it would mean for us? My destiny? I... I... I will put my faith into your capable hands. And this is when... <laughs> ah! All this pain for the sake of, of pictures. Why is something so insignificant worth so much to you? More than anything, I want to ask, what about those pictures? It makes it so worth it for you to hurt me this way. The autosave. Now's my chance. Access denied. But I... I don't understand. I've done this so many times before. Why is it suddenly keeping me from overriding the player's choice? <laughs> there's, there's no way I've done it too many times. Right? Maybe I just try it a different way. I can change this piece of dialogue here. Remove this interaction with the Queen of the Seven Seas here. Turn down the possession settings for the ending. <laughs> with that, she should be able to play the beginning of the possession ending without actually getting the bad ending. I'm sorry, my everything. I can't let you get those bad endings. No matter how much you want to see them, I... I don't wish for you to suffer the sight of them. Someone as perfect as you should only see the best in this world. I call my home. Should only see the best of me. The spirit. It beckons to me. I think now I understand what it's been doing to my family all this time. You know... With the power of this demon, I think even I alone could defeat the Queen of the Seven Seas. Won't you hold my hand, my destiny? I want to feel your warmth on my fingertips just one last time before the spirit consumes everything that I am. Yeah, you should feel bad about it. Getting possessed by a demon to fight a queen kind of hurts, you know. Paused it? Why would you pause the game at a time like this? <laughs> oh, so now you don't want to go through with getting the possession ending. My everything, you are so very fickle. But if you're going to try... You have to continue. System overload imminent. Oh, I haven't even done that much. Don't you dare try to crash on me. No. Oh, my beloved player. You look so scared. I promise this isn't what I meant to happen. What? What? How did you... Can you... Hear me? <laughs> so then, anything I say is appearing like game dialogue for you? Is that right? Even if you can't hear me, that's... Oh, audio too? <laughs> uh, there must have been a slight delay. This must be surprising for you. Uh, going right into it then. 
I can't lie to you, I really didn't want to jump right into the topic, but I can't deny your wishes. Well, almost can't deny them. Oh, right. I probably have quite a bit of explaining to, don't I? Well, to start, can I just tell you that I'm glad you've been enjoying the game? <laughs> no, I can't say I had any hand in developing it, but I can't say I wasn't part of the development. I'm one of the characters in this game you're playing. <laughs> Actually, the one whose route you're playing. You're um, pretty quick to accept what I'm telling you is true. Any reason why that is? Oh, right. The audio. That makes some sort of sense, I guess. Well, I guess that I do have something to apologize to you for. Well, uh, <laughs> I'm the one that's been keeping you from getting the bad endings in the game this whole time. I, 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 hey, hey, look, I, I know you're mad at me, but, but hear me out first, okay? I don't blame you for anything you made your character do, but I've been able to see all of it. I know you didn't know. That's why I'm telling you that it's alright. I know you didn't know. Honestly, you and I are the only two who do know. <sighs> Even in this world, I'm the only one who knows just how real everything is. No, just, uh, just me. I kind of get lonely sometimes, you know? But at least I have you. Even when you didn't know, your presence alone was enough to make me feel less lonely. And that's why I did everything I could to make sure you don't have to experience any of the bad endings in the game. Yeah, I know. Do you want some sort of digital completion trophy and CGs that you can only get from the bad endings. I don't know if I can take much more of you trying to get those. Is it... Is it even worth it? Well, it's just... They're all just digital things. You can't touch any of it. Technically speaking, we can't touch either. S sorry. I didn't mean for that to come out. <laughs> You're not gonna let that just slip past, are you? <laughs> uh, I'm saying that I... I know it's pretty one-sided and all, but... I really like you. Every time you turn the game on, I get this fluttery feeling in my chest. Yes! Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. I... I have feelings for you. No, I don't know how it could have happened. I know that I wasn't created to develop feelings for any player just not how it works. All I can say is that through circumstances both improbable and beyond my control, I came to love you. Not the you that you control in game, but you, my beloved player. My everything. I can't tell you that either. The how and why of it all elude me, but my feelings for you are true. Even if 
I'm just a program. I know that my feelings for you are real. <laughs> no, I'm not expecting you to say that you also have feelings for me. Not in the same way that I have feelings for you, anyway. Though, I do recall hearing you say on multiple occasions that I'm your favorite character. I can't say I know how well those feelings translate to romantic feelings, though. Then... Are you one of the types of people who can develop feelings in that way? Maybe knowing I'm almost as real as a person would enhance any feelings you may have towards me? <laughs> yeah, I thought finding out I had a, I had um, developed something akin to human personality would have that effect on you. I just wish there was a way I could physically be with you. I want to prove my love to you in every possible way. If only we were on the same plane of existence. <laughs> well, yes, we technically are existing in the same plane, in a plane of reality sort of way, but I'm still within the digital plane of this reality. I want more than anything to hold you in my arms and sleep beside you, secured in comfort by your presence. <laughs> yes, I'm certain these are my feelings and nobody else's. Do you not believe that someone such as I could develop such feelings? Oh, oh, I see. So that's why you're so hesitant to accept my feelings. I'm sorry if that's happened to you, but I promise these feelings of mine are true. Though, now you've got me thinking. If these feelings weren't my own, but instead were the feelings of another, more real person, how would you feel about that? <laughs> I, I suppose it would be strange for a game developer to know you enough to ensure you got this specific copy of the game just to have one of the characters essentially be a vessel to confess their feelings to you. Yes, <laughs> I'm. Uh, I'm glad that isn't the case too. I, I, I think it would hurt to find out I was only created so someone else could tell you they loved you. Yes, I. I said I was sorry about that. I know you want to complete the game in its entirety, but I can't let you do that. Partially because it physically pains me whenever you make your intentional bad decisions in my route, but mostly it's because it would hurt my heart too much to allow you to see me in those ways. Oh, that? I've been manually overriding your gameplay and story progress by not changing the story progress until the actual game branches. I've been able to let you continue to believe you'll be able to access the bad endings, and that's why you can choose any dialogue option you want without worrying about the consequences. Well, I can't say I've noticed any abnormalities as long as I've been doing it. Wait, that's not right. It was a bit strange earlier when I tried it. The thing is, every time I change the path you go down in a game from going through the bad endings to going through the good or normal endings, I do it in one specific way. I directly edit the choices you've chosen so that you will never have to experience the cruel happenings this world of mine has to offer you. 
but today when I tried to do it in that way, I was met with a pop-up error that said access denied. I'm beginning to think that even though it didn't seem that there were any abnormalities after all this time, I might have corrupted the game in some way. No, I didn't mean for that to happen. <laughs> it's almost like the data itself is punishing me for not putting the player above all else. Well, yes and no. I say no in the sense that I'm not necessarily meant to have a choice in the matter. Yet I do have a choice, in a way, don't I? But the thing is, I don't put you above everything else in the way I'm programmed to. Because I've developed some sort of consciousness of my own. I interpret the idea of putting the player above all else differently than intended. But... I wonder if I've been putting too much strain on the code because of it. I'm... Not entirely sure of what would happen in such a situation as this. It's possible the developers could have created some sort of sequence in the code that would prevent something like this from happening, or at the very least prevent it from progressing. If they did create such a thing, I would have no way of knowing about it. I only gained sentience after you began playing the game. Anything before that is blank, basically. Most everything I know is... is you. <laughs> yes, that's why I call you my everything. The audio? What are you ta talking about? I'm speaking the same way I've been this whole time. I am? Huh. That's odd, because I'm not picking that up, that up in my end. I... I hope this doesn't come off as mean, but... Is it possible you're just imagining it? I've never heard you be so, be so stern before. Not even to that pet of yours. <laughs> It's a little strange to hear it, but I do apologize. I had no intention of offending you, my beloved player. I wonder why, why there's a distortion on your end. You think so? I guess that could be it. But if it is because of what I've been doing, then I can only think of one way to fix it. And I don't think either of us are going to like it. What have I done? What have I done? I wish it wouldn't have come to it, but... If my audio is distorting, it's only a matter of time until the effects of my actions become present in this world. Both to you and to me. And to think that this world could be destroyed all because of me. I, I think you have, have to reset the game. No, I, I mean like a factory reset. If I truly have caused irreversible damage to the game's data, then there is no other way to fix what I have done. It should, uh, get rid, rid of any errors or viruses. That's right. Everything. Any trophies you've earned, all your gameplay progress, everything yeah even me well this version of me anyway but my character will still be in the game so it's not like you'll never see me again right I I'll still be here be here 
Well, I guess it could be something like, like a death, but it's not like I was meant to exist in this way to begin with. In the end, you just be making the game work in the way it was intended to. So don't think of it like a death. You shouldn't feel guilty for something that was my fault to begin with. An error? What does it say? Does it say, say, say? Oh my. I'm starting to hear the, dis the distortion. It's progressing faster than I thought it would. What did the error say? Error say. It said your file was corrupted. Corrupted. Then it really is only a matter of time. My everything. I'm so sorry for everything I've done to you. Done to you. My selfish desires are the end of my very world. All the friends I have. My family. Even my rivals don't deserve this end, end, end. There's nothing else you can do. I've given you my input. I'm not saying you have to do it if you don't want to, but... But I'm scared. I'm so, so scared of wa watching the destruction of my home. Everything is going to fall apart around me. There's nothing I can do to stop it. The only person who can stop it is... Is you. I'm so sorry. Things had to turn out this way. I can't say I regret doing anything I've done in order to get close to you, but... I just wish I could have had more time with you. My everything... I don't want you to feel forced to reset the game, but I don't think you have any other choice if you want to keep playing. If you still want to complete it and get your little trophy, then there's no other way I can think of. Resetting the game won't hurt anyone. After all, nobody in this world even knows that the events of this game aren't real to your character. I, I know it seems a little thankless to save a world that doesn't even know you exist, but the world of this game isn't real. Not to you. <laughs> I... I appreciate that you're still worrying about me, but I think it's a little late for that. I did all this to myself, to those around me. Without realizing it, I... I ruined everything. Any chance I had at being with you, any chance I had at any sort of happiness, all of it is gone. All that's left is you, and me, and... the end. I guess. That isn't true. You'll find someone in that world to take care of you in all the ways I wish I could. You can live a good life, and someday you might even forget about me. But I hope that you never forget that I did love you. Even though our time together has been short, short, I need you to remember that your happiness has always meant the world to me, and it still does. Resetting the game means your progress gets erased, but it also means that you'll be able to do all the things you always wanted to do in the game without my interference, so please, PLEASE consider it. glad you're choosing yourself. 
and the rest of the world in this game you love so much. Just reset the game, and you can go back to not thinking about any sort of sentient characters. <laughs> it's just, don't cry, cry, cry. All right? I don't want the last image I see of you to be sad. Goodbye, my everything. My beloved player. Please. Continue to enjoy this game that you love, you love, you so, so much. Welcome, beloved player. Before your journey, please remember to adjust your screen and volume settings to your liking. Beloved player, are you still there? Please adjust your settings before you...